What is up everyone? My name is Chaotix, and I'm bringing you one of the many demos of Octopath Traveler. In this video, we're going to be focusing on Therion. Uh, before we get started, let me explain a few things. I'm going to try my very best to go over to this game as thorough and as clear and as bestly possible to show this game to the best of my abilities as I possibly can. That being said, this is going to be a bit of a long video because story. RPGs have that, don't you know? <laughs> um, I will be doing a little bit of level grinding, but I'll be sure to cut that level grinding out so that way the video won't last for an eternity. <laughs> Uh, but with that being said, let's get into it, shall we? Your name is Therion. You are a thief. While your past is a guarded secret, your exploits are known far and wide. Members, 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 <laughs> whispers of your extravagant heist strike the fear into the hearts of the wealthy. Sorry, I barely read that. Uh, drifting into the Clifflands, one day you hear a rumor of a great wish to be had. You set your sights on a mansion said to be impregnable. Impre impregnable? Pretty sure, okay. Only to find what you've never expected. Sounds very interesting, doesn't it? So without further ado, let's get started. As you like it. I heard that thief's at it again. Really? What's he done this time? Lifted everything off a merchant, leaving the goldsmithy. Guess he didn't get his bill at that fancy manor the other day. Still can't believe he made it past all those gods. I'm sure the more the better for him. Hmm. They were more like decorations than actual guards. Oh, so they're talking about you. No point swooning over someone else's work. Someday we'll make it as big as that thief, and then we'll be the talk of the town. <laughs> yeah, you said it, partner. Partners in crime, huh? Seems that way. It was ten years ago. Our path cross. I remember the meeting well. After all, I had quite of my career. Interesting, ten years ago. <coughs> this character already. Really? 
does sound about right. <laughs> Don't look at the type that's gonna play nice with the guards. Hell no. <laughs> No. Hey. Ugh. Here. When the guard punched him and got him close enough for him to grab the key. to be after them. Ravis's treasure? If you are, I suggest you think again. Hmm. Heard another would-be fortune hunter was tossed in the dungeons yesterday. So what's the count now? A score? Maybe more? But House Ravis ain't known to be kind to those who covet their wealth. Still, poor thieves can't help but flock to that manor like moths to a flame. Suppose it's all those rumors of their riches that keep them coming. Some say it's enough to buy up the whole town and then some. Go on. Just one town? What about the neighbors? That's what I'm saying. Can't say for sure. No one's ever seen the treasure. Even that master thief they keep talking about would have more than his hands full. A perfect tale for the tavern. Look, when you've been in the business long enough, you can tell things at a glance. You're a smart and skilled young man. Probably have a long career ahead of you. That's why I'll say it once more. Stay away from that manor. Thanks for the advice. Next time, I'll have a tale of my own to tell. We're not gonna take his advice, are we? Okay, so first things first, let's talk about the radar. Um, use the radar in the bottom right corner to check your check the area and find your heading. Green is to progress with the story. Orange is to start up side stories. The feather are save points. Exclamation points are hidden items. And others are exiting neighboring areas. We can also toggle the um, radar with the R button. So as we see. Yay. Okay, let's, 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 let's get a look at a few other things. We've got the world map, fast travel, transport yourself instantly to any town you visit. 
Um, I don't know if you are able to go to other towns in this demo. I would be assuming so if you could do it in the last one. I don't know personally because in any of the demos, I, have, I haven't gone far enough to actually go to another um, town or city or whatever. But with this being said, if you are able to, you can that progress would be transferred over to the main game and you can do fast traveling that way. This also will work in the main game when you go to different uh, places. So you'd be able to fast travel to different towns, cities, yada, yada, yada. You get the point. Making it very convenient because I heard fast travel is a good thing, don't you know? So we have that. <clears throat> and also if you come up here, our journal, will basically keep us up to date on what we have done. So even if you put down the game for whatever reason and come back and be like, I don't remember what I have done, well, the game got you covered. And I kind of wish other games did this as well. <laughs> um, our inventory, let's see what we got here. It seems like we have a long sword and a dagger. Interesting. So healing grapes are uh, restore your HP. They're basically like potions. The uh, plums are basically like ethers. They restore our SP, which would also be like MP. Um, all of life are like revives or, or phoenix downs, if you will. Uh, they can help bring out a party member, but as you can clearly see, we don't have any other party members, so that won't be a thing. <laughs> Um, long sword, obviously, swords, daggers, we have a shield, we have a helmet, and we have, oh, we are pretty good on, uh, equipment-wise. Let's go ahead and take a look at our stats. So here is Therion's stats. Um, his class is Thief, as we already know. Weapon types, he uses swords and, uh, daggers. Hmm. Very interesting, very interesting. And also we have healing, but... We don't have nothing to heal. We don't have the ability to heal ourselves. <laughs> so, with that being said, let's go ahead and um, let's purchase some things. Let's see what we can buy. So we have. So here's the thing: I could buy two of them. So this would bring up my attack on my sword, and this would bring. Wait, wait. Swords. These are all swords. Okay. These are all my daggers. As you can clearly see, there's an axe and a bow here, but he doesn't react to it. Like, his picture doesn't light up, indicating that these are not for him. Let's keep that in mind. We can have better defense, which I, that's always my go-to thing. I like to have, I like to be really defenseful. I, I like to have high defense because I like to take hits like a pro, but that's just me. Um, I think for the time being, however, we will... Oh man, I kind of, I'm not sure. Cause that's gonna leave me, that's not gonna leave me for enough. What I'll do is I'll take the iron sword and I will equip this to me. And then I will take this dagger and also equip this to me. So that way I have a much stronger sword and dagger than what they have me started out with. Uh, if I'm able to make more, which I'll probably, because I'm a thief, <laughs> I will upgrade these as soon as I possibly can. We can also sell stuff as well. And as you be, take your time when you're doing this and don't make mistakes, look for the E so you know that you're equipped because you don't want to sell anything that's already on you. Not like I know that from experience. <laughs> Let's go ahead and sell that. And let's go ahead and sell this. Alright, so at least we have some better weapons. I already have some defense, so I'm not going to really worry about defense for the time being. Of course, it's going to be one of my main things to do. You talk to people, but I'm not really going to bother with that. I'm going to just get a move on. You know, but I just thought about something as well. Hold up. Let me go back down real quick. Can I? No, okay, we can't. Okay, I, I just want to see if we can do a thing. We can't. It's totally fine. Let's see what we got here. 
Also, we have the ends where we can save and uh, sleep at and whatnot. And, ooh, look at that, a treasure chest. And a very unusual looking treasure chest. These can only be opened by Therion. <laughs> Making him pretty useful in a party. And that was a weapon. Let's take a look at my uh, equipment. That was a dagger, wasn't it? Ooh, look at that. That's what I have on me, but this would be better. Yeah, physical attack, and my evasion will go up. We will equip this. Good to know. Let's see if anything else is around here. Any other treasure chests that can loot and make it a thing. We have items. This is going to be as far as I can go. Thank you. <laughs> Let's go this way. Ooh, treasure chest. <laughs> Money. Thank you. Let me, uh, I can't go into that house. You are, but I can get into this one. Oh, that's not a house. What was I thinking? Let's take me back down. That's the inn. Hmm. Cool, let's keep going. Oh, cutscene. <laughs> what do we have here? I would say so too. A lot of guards though. Alright! Oi! Yes! Listen up. My apologies. <sighs> I wonder if you have to fight that guy. Well, I'll be damned. What kind of place is this? Guard door? Yeah, it is really heavily protected. Oh. Hmm. Don't they? Jesus. <laughs> huh? Listen. Exactly. So it'll be really tough getting in. Oh. Uh -huh. So before 
we get our proof. Ooh, I don't tell me. Equipment. Or a headpiece, won't you? Oh! Yes, sir, yo, Bob. I will take that. Thank you. I sell some of that stuff that I don't need. Alright, let's head back. What do we have here? No. Ah, yes. Side. Okay. Uh, the truth is, ah, oh, I gotta make a name for myself. Do what thieves do best. And here we go with the path action. Utilize the character's unique action to overcome any obstacles. Each character in this game, all eight of them, have unique, different path actions. Our, our good thief friend's action is take a wild guess. You're probably right. <laughs> Alright, find the merchant with the letter. Okay. So let's see what we have here. Ooh. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, wow. Yeah, fire, oh, ice, wind, and shadow. Look, you don't need any of this stuff, okay? We're just gonna we're just gonna take it off his hands. He doesn't need it. He's a merchant. He's not going anywhere. Hmm. We're gonna get off from you. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take that off your hands. Don't worry about it. Let's see something. <clears throat> Inventory. What do you do? Evasion plus ten. Oh, balls yes. Equipment. There. <laughs> Make my life a little bit easier. Nothing here, nothing here. Hmm. What do you got? Ooh, restores BP. Uh, I don't really need that. Incre increase maximum HP. I will take you, and I will take you. Rest I don't need. <laughs> so let's go ahead and use that item, actually. Maximum HP. Why, thank you. <laughs> uh, 
Let's see, what else can we... Uh-oh. Hmm. Of course I've noticed. I mean, it could be anything. You guys were just jumping to conclusions that it's treasure. And? I suppose so. No thanks. Listen. Yeah. So if he's been inside, wouldn't that mean that he uh, at some point saw the treasure? for a second guys this is a dog barking okay I'm sorry about that guys I'm back Done here. Hey. What did you get, yo? Bye now. Shikes. Hmm. <laughs> 
Why is he by himself now? They, they took the hint. Good. Hmm. Yep, we need to get these letters. What do you got? Oh, healing grape, healing grape. Nah. Oh, good. Resource BP to his Ho 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 You have weapons. None that I can use, mind you, but doesn't mean I can't sell it. Let's back over that way. Let's head on down, shall we? I'm not gonna steal from anyone. <laughs> it's amazing. Also a good way to make some more extra money. A weapon fit for a rebel. Spear of Justice? Sure, I'll take that. Ooh. Some people talking right there. So from him. There we go. Now then. sell some stuff. So, I know that I can't use the axe, so I'm going to sell that. Okay. Can't use that anyway. Let's go ahead and sell this. Uh, that's what's equipped to me, right? Okay, so. Find that. Oh, and the spear. I don't need either. Buy some stuff. What to buy though? Oh, that's all you equipped on me. What do you do? Evasion. My accuracy would go up. This. 
I will buy this. Okay. Hmm. Okay. And then I have no money. <laughs> that is fine. <clears throat> Alright, let's head on over. Uh, as we just sold from everybody. <laughs> Basically. Let's get a move on. Making our way. We haven't gotten the one battle yet. Wait, is that a. No, no, that's not. Okay, I thought it was a treasure chest for a second there. Maybe it was. I'm not even sure. <laughs> My sincerest apologies. Summon me. <laughs> what the? Yeah, I'm a little bit smarter than the average bear. <clears throat> Desperate times. But the guy said there was traps. Save points. Well, this is a fantastic time to talk about save points because I can't save the game. Why? Because I already have a file ready to go that I spent my three hours on. That being said, thank goodness this game has auto saving so I can just use that to my benefit. So if I happen to die, um, won't be that bad. But as always in any RPGs, save save often anytime you see those little books with a little feather you want to save your progress hell make a safety save just in case you might screw up down the line you never know we're not going to be saving 
we are going to be looting. I'm more concerned about the traps. Not that way. This way. Ooh. There's a guard there. I guess it's not going to stop me. Broad sword. Hold up. Equipment. I have an iron sword. We will take that instead. I can steal all my stuff and been fine. Let's uh, go through that window now, shall we? <laughs> He's, he didn't see anything. We're fine. We're fine. Riches, huh? I mean, the place is pretty decked out. Hey, look, another save point that we're not going to use. Ooh, but I see a treasure chest. I'll make this quick. All right. Battle Basics 1, Breaking Enemies. Explore your foe's weakness to turn the ties of battle in your favor. Attack your foe's weak points and uh, to lower their shield points, reduce the shield points to zero to break your foes. So. Right off the bat, every enemy in this game has a weak point of something. It could be what you have on you, it may not be. But the point of the matter is, every enemy has a weakness. Find what that weakness is and use it to your advantage to kill them. Because as I say in any RPG, everything dies. That being said, every enemy in this game also have shield points. Uh, it could be one shield point, it could be seven shield points. Your objective is to break that shield points to get them in a daisy state so that way you can still use the weakness against them to take maximum damage. And uh, the, the, the Therion specializes in uh, swords and daggers. And fire abilities apparently. That's quite interesting. Out of my way. So, bam. So now he's weak. Which we get now to Battle Basics 2, Boost Mode. Into Boost Mode to augment your power. So, breaking the foe down, their defenses are going to be next to none. You want to use the R trigger to increase your boost, which uh, basically makes you more powerful. It takes your regular attack, that's their RAE2, and raises it to a much higher attack value to put the damage on them and basically kill them because again in rpgs everyone must die yes <laughs> my turn but uh the way i'm going to actually explain this is if you look at therion's name you see the two kind of yellowish orange glowy dots over his head that is your boost points every time you do an attack or basically any like if you did defend or whatever you are always going to have a boost point considering of your actions so we already saw that he's weak to the dagger uh let's see if he's weak to the sword yes he is over here my turn okay so next i'm going to take i kind of take full advantage of the fact that he missed let me see my thieves go i do have fire ability and i can steal too I have a 49% chance of stealing something off this guy. I'm not liking those odds. Hmm. Let's try fire. Don't play. Had to see. Ah, oh, good, he missed again. <clears throat> so, now, let's do the sword. And now that he's in a dead state, I am fully maxed out on that. So let's. I'm ready. Are you? I'm ready. And he's dead. And that's that. So this is a perfect time to introduce our victory screen, which is awesome, by the way. Um, so on here, you can see that I got a bonus for being untouched, and I got a bonus for break. So the untouched is basically that the enemy never touched me, right? I was unscarfed. He never hit me. I had two misses and I made it out alive. So we get a bonus for that. Plus two bonus. Um, for breaking his uh, 
exploiting his weak point and having him in a break state when he finished him off, we got a plus one on the XP. And if we were strong enough <laughs> to do this in one hit, we would have JP, and that would have gave us a plus, I don't know how many, um, for job points, and that would have been our bonus for that. Also, enemies do have the potential of dropping items as well. Uh, so yeah, but unfortunately he didn't drop anything because he's a cheapskate and we probably should have stolen from him, but that's besides the point. Okay, now, for this treasure. This will come in handy. I see a treasure chest up there. So let's take a look around, let's back up. This is the beginning of your end. The beginning of your end. <laughs> Try this! Right, nope. And he hit me. <laughs> oh, not weak to that either. <laughs> 20 something, so that's not good enough. Don't blame me. But you're weak to fire. <laughs> Let's see. That's 37%. I don't know. I'm, I'm not liking those odds. No, let's do the sword. That needs to do damage to him. He poisoned me. Jerk. You can, you can be stunned. So I lose health. Let's see. 79%. Do one more. 100%. Still a healing rate for him. Just use his healing rate. Oh, Thank you very much. Don't wait. I'm gonna break him. And let's go all out right on me. Death. And dead. And that's that. And we leveled up, thank goodness. <laughs> now, the good thing about leveling up, as you saw, I did take damage, even though I used a healing portion to get me up, but I used a lot of my SP. The good thing about with this game is every time you level up, it maxes you back out. So I have all my SP back and all my, my HP. You know my HP already came back with me anyway, because I stole from him. Like the good thief I am. I'm curious. There's plenty of things to look at. Let's go this way. This is the beginning of your end. What? <laughs> okay. Over here. <laughs> out of my way. Come out. I like how this game basically makes you strategize what you're doing here. Over here! Out of my way. Over here! Out of my way. Let's do this! He's out of the way. Over here! Out of my way. <laughs> and he's out. Where's the nearest tavern? Booyah. <laughs> Unfortunately, he did touch me, but it's it's whatever. We'll close to level three. We'll be just fine. The first thing I want to do. Oh. Okay, let's go into this room. And there's a treasure chest in here. Not healing great. And of course, not bad. Come on, I've got better things to do. <laughs> All right. Out of my way. This was a death. Over here. <laughs> Oh. 
my turn. Oh, his evasion is amazing. I'm ready. Are you? Where's the nearest tavern? I I I almost feel like he's probably one of my favorite characters in this game so far. So we got some money and we got some more exp. So that that all is fine and dandy with me. As we rob this place of all its riches, you know I. If if, if I was to think this wouldn't this be the my for end. what the. <laughs> You know what? Don't play. There we go. <laughs> Let's My see. Turn. What else could you possibly be using? Like A dagger. Over here. <laughs> but you're also weak to swords. Good. Ugh. Out of my way. I'm ready. Are you? All right, he's out of here. Out of my way. And now we can break you. Out of my way. Who's basically like, which way do you wanna take your time? Let's <laughs> say, and really figure out what you're doing before you really go crazy. Which I'm kind of, I, I was kind of wondering if they're gonna do because the same people who made um. Brady Default 1 and 2 made this game. I was kind of wondering if they're going to have the whole, like, make the gameplay faster. I haven't found anything that has that. What so, you know. This? I think this is, like, the, a good, nice speed for it. Nice. What was at level 4? Oh, if I didn't mention this, uh, if I do level grind, it's probably going to be between level 7 and level 8. Let's go this way. I remember seeing a treasure chest off this direction. So I'm gonna grab that first. Obviously that's where it wants me to go, but I'm not going there. Come on, I've got better things to do. Out of my way. This guy. This guy. This guy. <laughs> we're, just gonna, we're gonna get our boost points up. <laughs> I'm not gonna deal with his shit. My turn. Out of my way. Let's do this. Don't wait. Out of my way. Go again. Don't wait. And that's that. Yep. That is that. And we leveled up again, thank you. <laughs> we are level 4 now. For this treasure chest just over here. $800. I will take that. We will come back that shortly. I feel like there's other things we could be looking at. Hmm. Interesting. Nothing in that one. And of course, no boss fight. Come I mean, on, boss fight. No, a battle. My turn. Oh, you're not with the daggers. Forgot. This could be so awesome when I actually, like, when I get the full game and I can have anyone who this is out there, I'll be like, oh, okay. okay. Out of my way. Mind. Also, I wonder if there's going to be like an encounter thing because, again, with Bravery Default, you could make it max so you can have always run into an encounter, or you can make it minimum where you don't run into any kind of encounters at all. So, I wonder if they would do that again. Actually, let's do this. this. And that's that. Oh, but now we can actually talk about job points, or JP for short. Uh, you can now learn new skills. So let's go into skills, and we can talk more about that there. <laughs> so as you see, skills unlocked. 
I'm I'm 100 sure this is like the secondary class, but because I'm just doing the beginning chapter, we're not gonna be able to see this. <laughs> so let's go ahead and learn a skill. Learning skills. Learn a various of skills to gain the upper hand in battle. Use JP job points. Uh, you earn in battle to learn a new skill. And that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to learn a new skill. So, HP F attack a single foe twice with a dagger to steal HP. Huh, that could be useful. Let's see. Then we have reduce a single foe's physical attack strength by two turns. Reduce a single foe's physical defense for two turns. Slash a single foe twice with a dagger. To still oh, okay. This one we won't know till later. This one share uh SP. Let's go ahead and do th this one. I feel like that might come in handy. All right, back on the ground and stealing stuff. <laughs> What's in here? Nothing. Well, place is supposed to have a whole bunch of riches. I don't see any kinds of riches, and this is like in that door that they want me to go to. Things to do. My turn. Actually, let me see something. I poison him. So I wonder, it's like a boost? The dagger? Well, he's Don't dead. Start Whatever. things you can't finish. We're just making our way to level 5 at this point. <laughs> Which, by the way, level 5 is the recommended level for uh, any of the beginning chapters. Just a little heads up. We already checked out everything, so let's go in here. Actually, what? Okay, just want to make sure. Oh, and that gets to a battle. Fantastic. Come on, I've got better things to do. <sighs> so, let me summon. Let's go into the skill. Try this! Oh, wow! That will be helpful. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Let's uh. Jesus Christ! My turn. It's like jerk. Do you not do you not see what I'm trying to do here? <laughs> My turn. So I use this skill. I use this. This I would just do. Thank you for the HP. Over here. My turn. I'm ready for you. Stab him. <laughs> we broke you. My turn. And now, let's cut you down to size. Where's the nearest tavern? Awesome. Ah. Uh, yeah, I think he's gonna be my favorite character. <laughs> hmm. Upstairs. More so. Nothing here, though. Ooh, treasure chest. What is this? Uh, there it is. Deals wind damage to all foes. Right. Come on, I've got better things to do. My turn. My then, turn. we can do, ha! and we poison him at the same time, and he's dead. Don't start. But I don't even get any damage. bonus points for that. Oh, we did. Nice. <laughs> that was good. 
I mean, you can see the kind of strategy that you can do in this game. So let's go up another level. As we are slowly trying to rob this place. Again, no major treasures to be spoken of. I'll make this quick. Okay. <laughs> I was like, doing this. You. Over here. Oh, missed twice. Good. <laughs> Where's the nearest tavern? All right. And now I love right level five now. And we got a fire soul stone. It's in here. Ooh. We need to find a room. Hold on for a second. And you? On the other side of said room. I don't see anything worth stealing. Anymore. This is the beginning of your end. <sighs> okay, let's keep you broken and you, you should be fine. <laughs> Out of my way. <sighs> I'm ready. Are you? He sounds so angry when he does Don't that. Don't start things you can't finish. That's more experience point for us. But it's trust right here. Not a healing rate. There's two ways to go. Let's go down. Oh! Oh no 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 no. That means that we're getting close to a boss. But we I'll haven't looked at anything yet. <clears throat> My turn. Oh shit. Thank you. My turn. That was me. I screwed up. Out of my way. My turn. Let's do this. Let's break you first. So I get maximum damage. Let's do this. And that's that. Here. Huh. What's that on the table? Come on, I've got better things to do. What? <laughs> right, yes. <sighs> Out of my way. Back. <laughs> and kill him. Don't start things you can't finish. They are giving me really weak sauce on the uh things. I believe this one will increase my MP. Yeah, my SP. Oh, yeah, go ahead and do that. That little five right now. Okay, so it seems as if we are nearing the impasse because uh, that guy there normally lets me know, like, hey, we can, um, we're getting close to the boss. <laughs> so, with that, I, I'm on, probably going to start level to grinding now. Out of my way. Come on, yes! <sighs> my turn. Let's do this. 
Uh, I hate when I do that. There, he's out of here. Now he's dead. Where's the nearest tavern? Oh, that gave me some mad experience, though. Good, 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 good. So, yeah, we can actually start buying. Oh, you know what? Hmm. I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna buy a few of these. Okay, and then let's buy. Yeah, three there. So, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and level grind real quick. Uh, try to get to level seven, and I should be back here shortly. Oh, wait, we've got this. What are you? Inflict. Interesting. Now I'm gonna level grind. Don't start things you can't finish. There we go. So now we have a hundred job points. So I can show off two things. Well, one thing, actually. Now that we have a hundred job points, we go back to the skills. And we also have made to level seven, so I can get another thing. So I don't know if I want to reduce the foe's physical attacks. Or reduce the foe's physical defense. Hmm. I would feel like if I put the physical defense down to that would make them more deceptible. I'm gonna go with physical defense. And now we have unlocked uh, the, we have now unlocked the ability to do support skills. So, support skills are in the skills section, so let's go ahead and equip one. Equipping support skills, all you need to do is reap the benefits of, of these handy skills to equip them. So, we go into skills, go to equip skills, and then we can actually equip them. So, as we always saw off, it's for nothing, so what we see we get. When you use a non-damage skill on a foe, there's a 50% chance you will attack as well. Aha! Uh -huh. Interesting. Go ahead. Get on there. And uh, I'm going to uh, heal. Because, uh, well, one, I have more than enough of those. And I have more than enough of these. So we should be good to go. Hopefully, I do not get myself killed. I had a feeling it was this thing they were looking at. So, this is the amazing treasure everyone is talking about. It looks like an ordinary gemstone to me. Can't imagine it's worth all that much. I'd probably say the same. But then, what happened to the other three? The jewel before you is worth more than your mind could hope to fathom. Who the hell said that? <laughs> Your inability to discern as much is disconcerting, to say the least. Who the hell are you? Not just anyone can sneak up on me like that. Exactly. As we have an airplane, I should be the one asking you that question. Thanks a lot, airplane. I had no control of that. I should be the one asking you that question. 
Not just anyone could have made it this far into the manor after all. You won't get answers by stroking my ego. I meant it as nothing but genuine praise. Allow me to congratulate you on being the first thief to make it here. You say it as if you wanted this to happen. Just so. We tightened security for that very purpose. We figured no thief worth his salt would be able to turn down such a challenge. So this was a trick. Go on. To this end, we even asked the barkeep for help. Mm. I see. His job? Find promising thieves and spin tales about this manor. There is no treasure, is there? In other words, you tricked thieves into trying to rob this place. Think of it more as appealing to their inner nature. The great treasure of Ravus Manor, guarded by a veritable army. What thief could pass up such glory, such riches? We had such high hopes, but were constantly met with disappointment. And I'm the first to make this far. But finally, one has proven himself worthy. I should have seen this coming. To be truthfully honest, I kind of had a feeling we were being duped from the beginning. And yet you did not. And I find myself most grateful for your lack of foresight. So what's your angle? I need not explain that to you. You're going to trick me to come into your establishment to steal nothing, and you're not going to tell me shit? And I'm the one that got the furthest, and obviously you're going to use me to my benefit to do stuff for you. Wow. Yeah, don't like these people at all. Hey, this is actually kind of a foreshadow of me in real life and people with wealth that I don't, you know, well, I can't say that to everyone. I've met some nice ones, and I met some mean ones as well. <sighs> Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Heathcote. I am a butler in the service of House Ravis. You expect me to believe an ordinary butler snuck up on me? Anyway, who you are won't matter once I'm out of here. Now, if you'll excuse me. Oh, damn! I assure you, you won't be going anywhere anytime soon. Uh, you wanna bet about that? What? Uh... Let's go. Let's get this over with. <laughs> okay. Let's, let's think about this for a second. This butler is no ordinary butler. For, sh for sure, he's not ordinary butler. Let me see. Reduce. Uh, I don't want to use that just yet. Let's see what you guys are weak to. Let's go with the guard. Not weak to daggers. Over here! Good. What about the sword? Yes! Yes. Over here! <laughs> Melody, you shit. Let's see what we can do here. Let's see. Fire. 
Not with the fire. Okay. <laughs> My turn. Yes. This week is swords. Not enough for me. Cause I'm about to break the crap out of you. Boost him! I don't fucking care. <laughs> Over here. You haven't noticed I've been attacking you way. this entire time. Let's do this. Let's go. Still alive. Over here. Over here. My turn. My turn. Guys, evasion is really high. Out of my way. Good. Broken again. <laughs> Let's do this. There. Gone. Now it's just you and me, old man. My turn. Oh, so wait, you're not weak to value this? Yes, you are. Well, you know what it's time to do? It's time to get some of my HP back. Careful about this. Let me see something. The two turns. I got a crazy idea. I see. My turn. Let's do this. Let's see if we can get the poison on him as well. You're too tired. Uh. Uh. Yeah. Huh. It's nice to be back to normal. My turn. The fire, good. <clears throat> Out of my way. Yeah, I'm still standing, my old turn. man. Let's do it again. The shit? You can't. No. I've learned my met lesson with this kind of nonsense. <laughs> We're just gonna take care of the old man now. Let's break him. Out of my way. Let's do this. There we go. What? Oh, you want some too, eh? Got it. Out of my way. Ah, oh, shit. I fucked up. Yes. <laughs> Over here. Out of my way. And break him. Out of my way. Do, do a regular attack. That's not gonna help you. I'm ready for you. There we go. Where's the nearest tavern? That's how it's done. Ooh, what's this? Interesting. So, you can hold your own in battle as well. Well, no shit. How do you think I got this for? It seems I underestimated you. That makes two of us. Was that a part of your butler training? 
I see you still have some reservations about my true profession. Um, no butler's gonna be fighting me like that, okay? Though I'm sure my victory here lends my words no credit. Your victory? Uh, I believe we the ones that won, not you. What in the... The hell is... Any thief worth his salt should recognize that band. The mark of a convict. The fool's bangle, as some call it. Undeniable proof of a thief's humiliating blunder. Get this off of me! I do not take my orders from you. I've attached it to your arm for a reason. If anyone is to see it, they shall know of your failure here today. What, you? Bastard. However, I imagine your pride will not permit you to be seen with it. And that makes it perfect leverage for negotiations. <sighs> what the hell do you want? Negotiations? You may have broken into my home, but for now, I will overlook your transgressions. Oh, great. More company. I know, right? Bring the party on, why don't you? Pardon my belated introduction. My name is Cordelia Ravis, and I am the Lady of the House. Regards to your decorator. They sure have a way with traps. Allow me to explain. The treasure you are after is a family heirloom known as the Dragonstones. Yeah, don't say. Here we go. The Dragonstones have been in my family for generations. Wait, Dragonstones? I see one. Obviously, there's supposed to be three more, so all together, four of them? Yes, once there were more. But the stones were stolen during the chaos following my parents' passing. Fortunately, Heathcote was able to recover the Sapphire Stone. What touching devotion. Is this the part where I move to tears? Perhaps, once you understand your place in this story. If you collect the three remaining stones, we shall remove the band from your arm. So, this was your plan all along. Yes, but please understand, I had no choice. Well, aren't you too clever? Setting a thief to catch a thief. Don't thieves often say, the ensnared has only himself to blame? Yeah, they do. For a butler, you sure know a lot about thieves, old man. That's what I'm saying. I dare not bore you with my story when there are more pressing matters at hand. You were a thief at one point, weren't you? Will you undertake Miss Ravis's mission, young thief, if you refuse? Again, like I have a choice. I'll do the job. Excellent. 
then I pray your journey will be a successful one. Yeah, whatever. <clears throat> wow. Ain't that beat all. Oh, you're back. With a tale to tell, too. I'll trade it for a drink. Afraid I don't deal in that currency. Listen, I just came from Ravis Manor. Had a lovely chat with a fellow named Heathcote. Maybe you know him? I did warn you not to go there. So, was it everything you expected it to be? Absolutely not. All that and more, and now I'm awfully thirsty. I might need two drinks to get this bad taste out of my mouth. <laughs> Coming right up. <sighs> he did warn us, though. Head out of town. I feel like there's gotta be a way to get that damn thing off of us, though. Let's head out. How much did I have on me? 2,000? Ah, not enough. Let's get the hell out of here. Get this job over with. <sighs> this is gonna be fun. <laughs> this is gonna be fun, fun times. I do say so myself. Mr. Therion? Mr. Therion, please wait! Now what is it? Ugh, what now? I came to see you off on your journey. As it is at my behest that you're setting out. Look, I'm just fulfilling my half of a bargain. Nothing more, nothing less. I understand that, but... He's right, milady. This is simply an agreement between us and a skilled but short-sighted thief. I got your short-sighted thief for you. Exactly. There is something you should know before you go. As you saw, I recovered a blue stone. It is known as the Sapphire Dragonstone. Your point? The remaining three are the Dragonstones of Ruby, Emerald, and Gold, each named for its sheen. And if I steal them all back for you, you'll remove this band. You have my word. Your word? Well, that sounds legitimate. Any idea where I should start looking? Rumor has it that a scholar in Noble Court is researching the Ruby Dragonstone. Okay. Noble Court. Great. I'll fit right in. Mr. Therion! Oh, what is it? <laughs> What is it this time? Please, do take care out there. There's more to the story than they'll let Norn, isn't it? <laughs> Did I say something amiss? Never thought a man of my talents would be working for someone like him. Uh, it's nothing. You'll get your stones back soon. Just leave the thieving to me. Oh, what a way to go. <clears throat> Set forth his mission. Uh, I feel bad. I like this character. This is, this is what he has to deal with. 
He has to retrieve stones from people who tricked him to go find a thief. And why do I have the impression in my head that our friend, our partner, is one of the thieves that we have to get this from? Probably the main person that we have to take out. Wow. Here we go. Here we go. But with that being said, that is all the time I'm gonna have for you all today. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. It really means a lot to me. And let me know what you think of Therion. Are you gonna play as him? Are you gonna get the game? Please let me know in the comments below. But with that being said, I'm gonna end this off like I always do. Make sure you all have yourself a safe, fun, amazing, fantastic day. Kind of made new arrangements about that. Always stay coolly. My name's been Chaotix, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. But until then, later.